change. Now, change is a friend of mine. I got ten pennies for your dime. A penny for your thoughts and a penny for your advice. Now the pennies in the give a penny, take a penny trays at the corner stores. Those pennies are like thoughts and ideas and opinions. Sometimes you got two cents to give, and sometimes you need somebody else's two cents. And sometimes when you need somebody else's two cents the most, it's not even there. And sometimes you just don't even notice that the cup or the pennies are there. Whether it be because you just don't seem to need it, or just don't seem to care. Now whatever the case may be, the potential for the cup and the giving of the taking of the two cents, now, now that is a constant. You can take out all the change you got, lay it right out onto the table, but you can't make somebody pick it up. Send a horse to water, but you can't make him drink. And you send a lad to school, but you can't make him think. And you send me to the street, but you can't make me sane. <laughs> Only I can do that. Now, once in a while, you'll find that proverbial penny cup in places you'd never even expect. Like, once upon a time, I was at a spot with a handful of tweakers, you know, the speed demons. And in the mix of the rambling conversation, I overheard a two cents that wasn't even directed towards me. But I decided to pick it up. The only person that can make you mad is yourself. Now, emotions, they can and they will change. Change your way of thought, change your actions, or create the whole butterfly effect and change the path that you were on. Now, you can rarely be in full control of your emotions but you are in control of your actions, and more importantly, your reactions. To every action, there is a reaction, which will make this a constant. Now, the reaction to a situation will affect the outcome more than the action itself. If the reaction is the uh, butterfly effect, then the initial action would be the cocoon, the chain. Now, I can't speak for everybody, but most would agree that the butterfly is more beautiful than the caterpillar. But what most don't take into consideration is the transformation, the cocoon, the change. Now that, that is beautiful. When I see something change, you can plaster my face with a smile. Now, once upon a time, when I was just a, just a small boy, my grandpa, he, he told me how to find change. He said it's everywhere. He said it's on the sidewalks, it's in the couch cushions, it's in the change deposits on the pay phones and the video games and the arcade machines. It's everywhere. You just gotta look for it. And once you find it, now what you do with it, now that's up to you. The change just just lays dormant in various places, just ready to be found, just eagerly ready to become the butterfly. Now, there's no guarantee now because, well, nothing's a hundred percent, but change can set you free. It works for the caterpillar. Now, now I'd have to say it's odd when one thing can be the easiest thing and the hardest thing all at the same time. Changing yourself, your thoughts, your actions, changing your two cents, they all fall under this oddity. And it's also strange, because for everybody, there comes a time when they seem to forget that they are somebody. Now, somebody ought to do something about this. Why? Cause even when it's pouring, you 
you can avoid the rain And those caterpillars won't be soaring Unless they embrace the change And those pennies in the cup Won't have any effect Until somebody somewhere realized that They needed to change can change a day and change can change a life I've said it before and I'll say it again Got ten pennies for your dime Oh, do you have the time? With 60 seconds left, it'll change The rivers, creeks, and seas Are bound to change to rain There's even variables In the constant I reach into my pocket, find two pennies and a ball of lint of simplicity seems to make the most sense. A hundred pennies and a dollar, and that's my two cents. Hey, keep on playing there, brother. Hey, thanks, man. Thank mm -hmm. you.